Hillers softball won their first two playoff games at home to earn a trip to the semifinals against seventh-seeded King Phillip. King Phillip got the offense started in the top of the second inning. Bases loaded, no outs led to this. Bradley deals. And this is hit in the air, and that is going to go off the glove of Lily Morningstar and drop down for a hit. One run in a score. Bradley deals. This is up the middle, glove by Whalen. Tags one, throw to first. And they are going to call her safe at first. Another run does come around. And this is on the ground, up the middle, glove by Whalen. Throw to first, and they get one. That is going to be another run for King Phillip. Besides an additional King Phillip run in the top of the seventh, that would be it for the offense and complete the Hiller season as they fell to King Phillip four to nothing. Callie McGain pitched the complete game and got the shutout over the Hillers. King Phillip then went on to beat undefeated Silver Lake in the finals and advanced to the Division I Final Four in the state. Congratulations to King Phillip and congratulations to Hillers head coach Kylie Murray on a great first season as coach and the Hillers players for some amazing memories. Another team that created some great memories this season under a first year head coach was the Hillers girls tennis team. They went all the way to the championship of the South Division II bracket, but fell to Foxborough 3-2. Congratulations to the Hillers girls tennis team and first year head coach Christine Lyons, who helped lead the Hillers to an undefeated season in TVL play. Ashland Legion Baseball held their home opener at Ashland High School on Tuesday, June 14th against Newton. Top of the first, two outs, two on for Newton. Mike Butera at the plate. Time delivering from the stretch. Runners both taking a small lead. Up the middle, right to the second baseman. Throw to second for one. Throw to first is not going to be in time. And now the runner trying to come home. He'll score. One to nothing, Newton. Alex Haslam taking advantage of the situation. Comes all the way from second base to score. 2-0 Newton trying to add another in the top of the fourth. Two outs, two on for Alex Haslam. Time deals, runner taking off from first, and this is hit into right field. That'll drop in front of Sharma. Another Newton run around to score. The throw to third to try to get the lead runner was just bobbled by Bates. Ashland threatened against a relief pitcher in the seventh, but Newton held on for the 4-1 victory. Ashland fell to 0-2 on the season with the loss. Ashland post-77 would lose the back end of a home and home with Newton the next night, 12-8 to fall to 0-3 overall.